Not bad. For a half full of 13.4 gallons. Welcome back, guys. If you haven't already noticed, it's a rainy, stormy day. And it's supposed to rain like this for the next couple of days. It's the storm passing through the Midwest and the eastern part of the United States. And we're car camping in this mall right next to none other than Coles, if we can find it. All right, we made it to Coors. Coors, <laughs> it's Coles. <laughs> Coors is something to drink. <laughs> ah, that's so funny. Check out this nice little thing they have going on here with the plants and the trees, whatever you call them. It's very nice, the scenery, when you come up to Coles. I called it Coors. <laughs> I was thinking about having a beer, so that's where that came up. Well, welcome back, everyone. We in a mall right next to Coles. I forget what the name of this mall is. But it's a huge parking lot where you can day camp. I'm not sure you can stay here overnight, but it's gonna be raining the next couple of days with this storm that's passing by. We're supposed to be in the spring now, but it is April 2nd. By the time this video comes out, it'll probably be a week after April 2nd, but this storm is crazy where it's gonna be raining the next three to four days. Today is Tuesday, it was raining since yesterday, and it's supposed to be raining until Thursday. But I'm gonna be staying in places just like this and the mall, just chilling out. And we're gonna try out some new mattresses, the air mattress from Joy Tutis, I think it's called. Yes, Joy Tutis. Uh, we're gonna be trying out a mattress from them just to see how it is, how it works out. I'm fasting for the today, so I'm not gonna be eating much in the video. I may drink something or I may not, but I am fasting for the day. So let's get started like setting up the RV, well, the SUV for this um, camping video. All right, so one of the first things I'm gonna have to do is set up the car. So let me get out, make sure I have my keys on me. I'm gonna get out and set up the back. So this car is really cool because you can set everything flat when you are setting up for your air mattress. I do have a car seat back here. I'm going to see if I can set up the air mattress without taking the car seat out. If I do have to take it out, there's uh, no problem. I'll do that. But let me uh, go to the back to uh, drop the back seat. Okay, I'm all the way in the back. Let me see if I can drop the back seat here. Ooh, got my ball. That happens sometimes. My ball went rolling down the aisle there. But there is something where you can drop the back seat. There we go. Uh, let me see. Maybe I need room for this other back seat. Let's try it out. The mattress that we're going to be using for this camping video is from Joy Tudis. Forgive me if I'm butchering the name, but this mattress is specifically made for SUVs. You can see by the labeling, SUV air mattress from Joy Tudis. So let's air, let's blow this bad boy up and see how it works. I'm going to show you the inside of the, uh, the truck. We're in a 2021 Chevy Tahoe. Big, big, a lot of room in the back. I mean, I can spread out. I'm six foot two. I can spread out all the way back there. So I'm going to let you guys see it. I'm going to let you guys see the space. And let's get started installing this mattress. So this is the large amount of space we have in the back. The seats fold down flat. So you have a lot of room back there just to relax and just chill out. So let's blow this mattress up. Okay, blowing this mattress up shouldn't be that difficult. Sorry for the mess. I had some stuff in the front that I didn't clean out, but I had to put it in the front seat. This is nice packaging here. Joy Tudis. It has an instruction manual inside the box, which is pretty cool. 
I may have to refer to that because I'm going to do this whole thing without referring to uh, much to the instruction manual if I can do it. But if I can't, I'm going to have to refer back to it. I'm going to set the bag over here. I'll leave this box there. I mean, the packaging is really great because you have everything you need inside. Oh, if you get a puncture, they give you little things to they have a glue and a sealant. Just in case you get a puncture, you can fix the, the puncture in it. So I'm glad that they sent that because at least that they realize that that can happen. Let's see if we can get this seat belt out of the way, which we probably can. And what is this? Is this a pillow? Give you two pillows in here. These are nice little blow up pillows, which is pretty cool. And I have a power station, small little power. Well, this is not small. I believe this is an 800 watt power station by AI Volt that I'm going to use for, to blow up the mattress. We do have a 15 amp outlet in the car, but I don't like using that much when it comes to blowing up these uh, air mattresses. So let's unfold this air mattress. Again, everything is going to be live, showing you everything of no cuts in it so that we can see exactly what you're getting when you buy it. And we can see how big it is, how wide it is. We're going to show you everything. I can set this up here, this out of the way, get this out of the way. So this is a pretty large air mattress here. Let me see where the nozzle, the nozzle is on the other side. So we're just going to shift that around just to show you exactly where it is. So I'm going to bring the pump around and we can blow up that from that side as well, just to make it easier. Okay, so let's switch sides now. I'm going to switch the angle that you guys are watching. Okay, so I'm in the back of the car now, and of course, I forgot the thing. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. I have the AI Volt portable power station, and we're going to use that to blow up the uh the air mattress you have it comes with the 12 volt little adapter that converts the 12 volt plug into the normal uh 12 amp outlet so it doesn't have much power i like when i get little devices like that where you can see exactly what you're getting so this plugs right into the uh the pump oh you have a 12 volt option that's pretty nifty here that you can use the 12 volt option i'm going to use the 12 volt option instead of using the 15 amp option because 12 volt you always go with 12 volt when you're doing this type of lifestyle i didn't realize it came with both so that's pretty cool and you have like different little connections to see which hole you want to fill out which um device you want to you want to fill up so with the uh, portable power station i'm just going to cut it on the AI, ai volt we had 100 percent. you turn on the dc power and then you have a hole in the back here you can see which one fits into the hole the best and then you connect the pump let's see which way you connect the pump yeah, we're going to stay alive here. When I figure it out, that's what you guys got to figure it out. We did this together. Oh, that's the way it goes in. That's pretty cool. So let me see which one of these fit in best. Oh, does that way fit in even better? Yes, it does. So we're going to put this in here. Let's connect this into here because it snaps right in. And then we can stuff this in here because it fits in that way too. And then we can cut the pump on. I saw a switch somewhere on it. Oh, it's in the front. And let's see if it powers on. We have no power now. 
That's weird. I don't hear anything. Okay, let's try the other power option. Hopefully this pump is working. Let's try the AC power. Okay, we got power. So let's use the error there, I guess. So let's turn it on again. And we're gonna start pumping this bad boy up. And then I'll bring you back when this is all fooled up. Pumping up. Joy to this. So this is the ending setup for the Joy to this air mattress. Let's see how comfortable it is once we get in. We have two pillows followed by the air mattress. And this is a Chevy Tahoe 2021 off-road. And I still have some room in here. I can push it up and still have trunk room. So it's pretty cool. You can't beat that. So to give you guys some insight on how comfortable this really is i'm six foot two nearly 300 pounds and i can set this up any way i want where i can watch tv comfortably i don't want any copyrights so right now i have on my own youtube channel just to show you how comfortable it is you know i can lay down and surprisingly this is like very very comfortable I can put my pillow here or I can bring pillows from the home, but this is more compact because you can put it any way that you want. You can lay down, you can get comfortable. This can easily fit two people. Oh my God, this is more comfortable than my bed. I can sleep really, really well in here and with like blackout curtains and everything like that, you could just stay in here and nobody would know you in here. And especially for a day like it is today, where it's raining and it's foggy, you know, no one knows you're in here. With window covers, whew, those will be absolutely phenomenal. But I'm stretched out. My arms are up. I can sit up. I can watch TV. I can put the TV on this side or this side. I mean, this is like really, really cool where I can watch TV, play video games and do whatever I want inside this great air mattress from my joy to this so this is like uh it's pretty cool i really like it one thing i like about sitting here is that no matter what you're doing you can relax I think my tv fell no that wasn't my tv my tv is still up you guys watch sports i'm watching the ncaa women's tournament and oh my god it is so excellent like i said this video, I'm doing it on April 2nd. By the time you guys see it, we'll probably be after the Final Four, which is going to be going into the championships. But yesterday, LSU went against UConn, and Iowa went against LSU. Wow, it was so awesome. I hope I got that right. It was Iowa and LSU and USC versus UConn. That's what it was. It was Juju Watkins going against Kate uh, Paige Beckert. And then there was Caitlin Clark going against uh, Angel Reese and their respective teams. Wow. It was phenomenal. And I couldn't believe it. You know, I, I wish I would have watching it in here because this is like nice and cozy, especially sitting on this Joy Totus uh, mattress here, SUV air mattress. But it is so cool. Like, you can come in, chill, watch TV, play video games. So now I'm just playing some video games for a couple of minutes. Uh, and then I'll enjoy. I'll probably take a nap and see how everything is going. I love sitting here playing my video games. Like I can turn a little bit this way so that you guys can see what I'm doing in here. You know, you can sit in, chill out play video games this is the valve steam deck look how nice that screen is this is call of duty look at the graphics i mean you can't you can't beat anything like this
So this is why I love just sitting here, chilling out, playing. And this is what I do most of the time. Wow. Somebody got me. Somebody got me. I don't know who it was, but it's okay. I like to put this up here too as I'm playing so everybody can see the name brand of this of this uh of the air mattress while I'm playing. And of course I just got me one. Let's see what's going on here. But I, I they, oh, look at that right there. I like having all of the entertainment, like whether I'm in a home or I'm in the RV or I'm in the car, you know, I have unlimited internet. I have almost unlimited power and uh, I have my TV, I have my video games, you know, you have everything and you can just, it's just like endless number of hours of entertainment. You know, I carry cooking supplies too. I have like a portable fridge and everything I use just to keep myself going. Especially like in my line of work, sometimes you don't know how many hours you're going to be working, how much sleep you can get to your next shift. Oh no, I'm going to die. No, I got it back up. Thank you for this board. And that's one thing that I do enjoy. Somebody's up here. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? He's somewhere. I, I think my partner got him. Oh, where am I? This this game is pretty cool. I don't know if you got. Oh, somebody's hitting me right there. I got hit. Up, oh, I got hit. That that's what happens. So as you guys saw, this air mattress is very easy to hook up. You know, you just have to have a DC or a 12 amp power source. And you can blow this mattress up. If you're in the sticks and bricks, you can blow it up in your home and then put it into the, the car. Or you can use your DC uh, output to, uh, to blow up the air mattress. You just have to make sure that your DC output has enough power and your portable power station to power the air mattress. That's why I guess it comes with two. It comes with the 15 amp plug and also comes with the uh, 12 volt plug. But both are sufficient enough. And I'm still playing this game because I don't want to come out of it. Because if you do come out of it, they do, how you call it, they get, they deduct your points. And I don't want that to happen because my prestige on this game is, like, really high. And I want to keep it that way. I don't want to have any negative ratings on it. But this come, this mattress, I have my elbows in it. And you know some air mattresses you buy. You have your elbows in it, you have your knees in it, and you can actually go all the way through the mattress and feel the bottom. This mattress, I don't feel that. It's, it's nice thickness, and you, you actually can feel how nice it is. I mean, it, I don't feel lumpy. I feel very comfortable. Like, I can sleep in here for hours and hours. And I like having it on this little trip that I'm on now and this mall parking lot where no one knows that I'm in here, which is like pretty cool. And just to show you, I am online playing this. This is uh, Call of Duty. Uh, I forget which one is. I think it's Call of Duty 3, the online multiplayer, where, you know, you, you can see the kill cam and everything like that. It, it's really cool. While I'm sitting here on the mattress, this feels like I'm actually in my bedroom playing video games. Of course, I have my hat on, <laughs> I have a sweater on because I am outside. The car is still on, by the way. That's why the, the screens are on. I can hook this up to the screens and play through the screens, but I don't want to do that right now. It is pretty cool where you can hook up each of these screens separately. Like, you can hook one video game up to this. You can hook another video game up to that, but you have to leave the car on. I have the car on an automatic timer so that it will go off, like, I think it's 10 minutes. It will just automatically cut off. But this mattress, whew, you cannot beat it. You can't beat it. This is really, really nice. Oh, man. All right. It's about that time for 
me to take my little nap using these pillows so nice and comfy oh man i love this i like just the comfortability of the whole thing i'm gonna take a little nap and then i'm gonna get out of here i don't want to overextend my welcome but this uh mattress from joy to this is really really comfortable and nice i really like it i'll get back to you guys a little bit later when i'm getting out of here but this is like boring just a chill video you know just showing you guys the air mattress and you camping very minimal you don't need much in my other car i have almost everything that you can possibly need the whole off-grid battery system and all and this car, I just have the air mattress, I have a portable power station, I have my iPad and some video games just to, for entertainment. Still more than I need, but this is very, very comfortable. And this is, this is just an awesome way to just get outdoors and camp. And you have a long run and you don't want to spend money in a hotel. This is an awesome, awesome way that you can save money by staying in your automobile. Hotels are about $100, $200 a night. Your automobile, free. And all you have to use is one of these blow-up mattresses. This one is from Joy Tudas. I'm going to put a link down in the description and also in the comments. This is, like, totally awesome, man. I, I can't imagine not having this. It, it's very, very comfortable. But I'm going to take a nap, and I'll get back to you guys in a few. Just woke up and it's time for me to get all of this stuff back out of here. So you just let the air out here. Again, this is hard with one hand to do. You can just let the air out and it comes right out and you can fold it back up. The same with these pillows. Just open these up and whew, I was all comfortable and a little sidetrack. I'm camping while my wife is shopping. But kill two birds with one stone. Take as much time as you need. And I'll be in here relaxing and camping. Let me fold this up and I can take the air out and put it back in the bag. And just like that, the car is back into car mode and we're getting out of here. Slept a little bit too long. It's still raining. It's going to be raining for days. But... Thanks for joining. I'm not leaving yet. Let's continue this journey. So right now, we're back at base camp. I left the mall. To get this back in, it looks like it's kind of difficult, but I'm sure with the you take the time, you can get all the air out of it by compressing it and getting it back, getting that small footprint. But uh, sometimes these things are hard to get in. Sometimes you got to squish them in or however you can get them back in the best that you can. But I'm going to try the best. Hopefully I don't rip anything like the bag or to hold it in. But I'm going to get this back in there. I had to do get things in harder before and I was able to get it in. But just stay with me. This bag opens up and you'll be able to get it all the way tucked back in. It's slipping in now. I'm never the best at putting things back the way that they came, especially with packaging, but I managed to get everything back in. Again, this is like a rush job that I uh, put it back in, but it fit in. So, you know, if I did it, you could do it. But this again, this is from Joy to this. This is their SUV air mattress. You can use the 12 volt plug or the 15 amp um, plug that comes with it. It hooks up to your vehicle or you can have a portable power station. I use the portable power station to hook it up. But uh, again, this is from Joy to this. Great product. That's all I have for you this week. I have a tent by uh, Joy Tudas that I'm probably going to show in the next video. 
but I'm just waiting for all of this rain to stop. I had plans, you know, to cook and do a lot of the things, but I'm fasting. And also this weather really doesn't make me want to eat. Um, but probably, hopefully, when the rain stops, I'll cook a nice meal so that everyone can see. But that's all I got for you this time. Remember, guys, if you like these videos, hit the like button. Comment below if you like to know anything more about this uh, air mattress, SUV air mattress from Joy Tudus. Also, there's a thanks button right below. Anything you give us, anything we get for the channel, we put right back into the channel for our travels, whether it's filling up with gas, getting those groceries, doing everything. Uh, we put everything back into the channel. There's also where you can buy me a cup of coffee. You buy me a cup of coffee, I give you a shout out as I go to Dunkin' Donuts, Starbucks, or any of the local chain coffee shops. I give you a shout out if you buy me a cup of coffee. Check out the Smalls RV Adventure Store where you can get yourself some nice hats, gears, everything that you want to support the channel. And don't forget to check out our Amazon storefront. The Amazon storefront, you'll see all of these products. If you don't want to click on the links below, you can go to our Amazon storefront. The links that I do provide, they usually come from Amazon. So it's just going to reroute you to Amazon. Uh, sometimes I do have discount codes that I'll throw out to you. But uh, hit the links. Once you see the links in the description or the links in the comments pinned by me, uh, you can trust it because it's by me. And it will take you to an Amazon or wherever I'm getting the discounts from. So thanks again for tuning in. And I'll see you guys for the next video. See you later, everybody.